Welcome to part number 43 of Gran Turismo 5 Ace Mech. This is the Moving Chicane, and today it's time to go back to the special event series and do the Gran Turismo Intermediate Rally! So, this time it's five stages across dirt, snow, and tarmac. And obviously we're going to start off with dirt. Now, the car that I'm going to be using for the dirt section is... This thing, the Subaru Impreza Sedan WRX STI Spec C Type RA from 2005. We won this thing from a coupon 1000, so yeah. Please keep quiet. Oh. Are you talking about... Okay. Um, I'm actually wondering what you're referring to there, Ender. You're probably referring to a livery that you made. I have to check that out after the stream is over. Anyways, what are our competition like? Okay, so... A Delta and two Lancer Evolutions. Okay, cool. I guess. I am going to give this car a little bit more power just because I, I'm really bad at rally racing. So like a racing air filter and maybe a stage one turbo and that should do it. Yep, that's more than enough. All right, here we go. Stage one of the rally. Am I good with all wheel drive? Eh, it'll help. I mean, you you think all wheel drive cars would help in, in a rally situation. So I'm using this. <laughs> What's up, Tasty? I find it interesting how you're uploading your GT4 Prologue LP uh, GTSV just because, like, you're uploading them in, like, small individual parts, you know? You're uploading, like, one per exam when, like, Rufus did, um, you know, all of them per color coordination or whatever, like, gold, orange, purple, whatever the hell the colors are on in that game. I don't remember. Because I never played GT4 Prologue. Sometimes I feel like I should have played GT5 Prologue, because I'm going to eventually have to play that on the channel, but whatever. 600. Do I have a shifter? No. Uh, this, um... Oh, somebody spun ahead of us. Six cool, I guess. <laughs> um, this, uh, this wheel in particular uses, um, paddles, and it uses a, um, sequential up and down shifter. That's it. Oh, I see. And on top of that, isn't your computer really garbage at rendering, you know, videos and stuff? From what you're always telling me, because it takes you, like, 14 hours to render a two-minute video. The up-to-speed episode of the Subaru Forester? Hey. Hey. Actually, I, I think the Forester is a pretty cool car. There's this one dude at school who drives one, and it's really badass. It's like... He dropped it, right? Like it's dropped it's, it's dropped a bit. It's um it's like dark blue and it has like black rims. I think they're black like NK rims. They're super nice. Like it is such a nice forester that he has. Like he he did some really nice thing on it. <laughs> well, GTSV, where um at what um resolution are you rendering at? Because I was rendering at 1080p for no absolute reason. And honestly, there's only a small difference between 720 and 1080, in my opinion, when you, you know, because the videos are compressed anyways. Oh, I don't know if that's a true statistic ender, or I don't know if it's, you know, a joke, but it is an amazing car. Subarus in general are, are amazing. Mitsubishi's kind of suck, unless drive Lancer Evolution, but even then, as a former as a former Mitsubishi owner, I uh Yeah, I'm kind of like salty against the brand still. Just because my eclipse did not last very long. 
Yeah, somebody said Rally, but nobody said Salika Salika. Sorry. Ten eighty P Oh that's right, because you have you're playing the power region. Ugh. So you have to render at fifty FPS. Why was the resolution drop for you guys in Europe anyways? Straight into the wall, but it's okay. Yeah, I'm the only blue car out of a whole red car field. I should have painted it red, but how was I supposed to know they were all going to be red cars? Hey, but this is one of the nice things. This is, you know, excluding obvious um, manufacturer races like the Gallardo Trophy or whatever. This is like the only all premium field that I've ran into that's not a spec series or a manufacturer race. This will probably be the only field like this in the entire game. Oh yeah, I gotta turn off TCS. Oh, really? Subaru did make... Okay. Well, it's nice that Subaru's being inclusive. I mean... That's cool. I don't have anything wrong with that. Finish. And yeah, Jay, I agree with you. Yeah, I, I I had TCS in, in a fucking rally race. I I basically just shot myself. What's up, vet? How are you? So stage three is next. Let's turn off TCS from here because I hate turning it off every single time. How do you get so many credits by playing the game? Hello, co driver. How are you? He's looking at me like, mate, just fucking focus on the road. I don't want to. All right. Five, Next run. Here we go. Three, two, one. I want to fucking die. Long. No committing Snoku until the rally's over, sir. Oh shit. Yeah, he does. I, I think most of us have played. You know, I don't know. Me personally, I've only done this race with with standard cars, so I never really paid attention to the co-driver at all. And now I do, and now we can see that that he actually glances over at you when you look at him. That's a nice little detail that PD put in this game. Finish. Oh. Oh, really? Good for Rishi. I mean, he's still pretty dumb because he thinks the East Coast is better than the West Coast, but yeah, it's really nice. Now, in all seriousness, um, Rishi's fast. Rishi is, he's good. He's really good at GT Sport. He's really fast in that game. I like the rims, too. But yeah, I mean... It sucks because, like, I showed up to the stream super late again. Like, in the previous two Jimmy streams, I literally show up right when he's taken off. I'm like, ugh. And then I was on mobile, so then I couldn't even, um... <laughs> Jimmy was like, who is Rishi? 
Well, don't forget that Rishi's called like my family team on his PSN for some odd reason. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, nice, Alika. How did that go? I was watching that one-on-one -on -one between uh, Rick and Mikhail, and that was pretty good. Kind of made me wish I was part of that uh, action during that Lamar race, but eh. Probably wouldn't be the same if I made it artificial. 40 seconds. Ooh. Artificial as in I slow down purposely to catch up with them. I don't know. It's not really how a race works. I mean, he didn't really know who Rishi was. Are you sure he doesn't know who Rishi is? You mean like he doesn't know who Rishi is here is? Or as in like he didn't know my family team was Rishi? Because he jokes about Rishi all the time, like him being banned and stuff. Four seconds. Six hundred. Yeah, if you want to join a Jimmy lobby, what you have to do is this: you have to literally stream snipe, watch the stream, and put in every single like, like put in the track combo, put in all those settings and stuff in the in, in the lobby search or whatever, and then just pray. And just spam the hell out of the refresh button and the X button. That's the only way you can get in his lobbies. Alright, on to stage number five. I do game on PC, so iRacing, I have a set of Corsa, which I don't really play. I have Formula Truck, I have Wreckfest, which I'm gonna LP eventually. Um what else? I know I have some other stuff. I do have Project Cars 1, but I despise I despise it and I want my $2 back from G2A. I have Dirt Rally 1. Dirt Rally, or not Dirt Rally 3. Dirt 3. Oh shit, okay. I got it, Ender. Well, then again... Then again, I mean... You gotta understand too that like he's dealing with thousands of people on a regular basis whereas I'm dealing with tens and so when you have 2,000 people watching and so many people commenting at once you know you can't really expect him to know every you know everyone by name or everyone this I mean the only reason why he knows me by name is because I met him in Vegas you know we met him in Vegas met him met him and Chris we you know, I fanboyed for like the like the first minute, and then just regularly chatted with him after the um, after Fraga was was crowned America's champion, and then uh, you know just chatted and drank and whatever. So it was fun. Oh, got it. <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, dude, Rishi has a huge ass presence in his Discord. Like, you go to every single channel, and you see Rishi chatting everywhere there. Oh my god, it's getting tight. Oh, come on. Go, 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 go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm probably going to lose this stage. I wouldn't be surprised. Shit posting. Yeah, there you go. Ah, fuck. Come on, come on. I'm so bad at this. I'm so bad at rallying. Rishi the ace of blanks. Fuck it. Cheese it while I have the penalty. Oh, I'm still ahead by a second? Uh, okay, why not? RBR? I'm not sure what RBR is. Oh, Richard Burns Rally. Ah! 
I've never played Richard Burns Rally either. But everyone claims that it's like the Rally King, and I kind of have to believe them because I don't know shit about rallying. And I'm really bad at rallying. Yeah, this rally is bad. Alright, so slide you out the final corner. Ah, don't give me a penalty. No penalty, please, 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 please. Okay, we finished second, I think. I think that's the second place song. But if we finish second, we still win the overall rally, I think. Third. Oh, by only half a second. We won. We won the rally. We're good. 3.3 seconds. Yay. 91k and 15,400 XP. Sweet. And guess what, guys? We gotta do this all over again. But this time on snow rather than dirt. So, what I'm gonna have to do is, because I'm bad at dirt and I'm, a, I'm horrendous at snow driving, what I'm gonna have to do is this. So the next car we're gonna use is... This thing. Mitsubishi 3000 GT VR4 Turbo. Now, because it's kind of a heavy boy, I'm going to drop all the weight on the car and then obviously add the minor upgrades like the turbo and whatnot. Rally drivers enter and... Probably Indy car drivers, just because driving on an oval in an open cockpit car, it's it's crazy. Toyota Seven on Shimani or unsub? Well, you can unsub if you want. Oh, I just said that, didn't I? Too much power. Too much power. I think that barely meets the regulations. That barely meets the the entry regulations. I think, I think it's 346. If not, 3.45. Yeah, I mean, I don't know, man. I think motorsports in general, you just have to be kind of psychotic to do. Yeah, 3.45, so we gotta just drop a ho one horsepower. That's it. Oh! Hey, it's the boy that won at Nürburgring. Hello. All right, so snow tires. What's up, Dutchman? Oh, you're free? It feels good to be free, isn't it? It's a me, Superior the Jimmy boy. And it's a me, the boy who always joins his streams late nowadays, boy here. Oh yeah, dude, Fernando is really good. I mean, hey, he was my B-Spec driver. I trained him. See, I trained Fernando because he was my B-Spec driver, so any credit that he has to whatever he's done in his career, it's all, it's all thanks to me, guys. Okay? We all know that. <laughs> makes, makes him better than Matt Thomas by proxy. Yeah, training paid off, exactly. I mean, dude, driving at the Nürburgring in the night with uh, Suzuki Escuda without headlights? I mean, come on. I am Senpai. Exactly, yeah. I am Senpai. Why are you not being invited to Paris? Because you live in Florida. You think they want to have anyone from Florida and Paris? I know, I just went there. <laughs> Anyways, time for some snow driving. And it's super technical at the circuit. Oh, the AI is slowing down tremendously. In that corner. Okay.
Oh, it's the Audi Quattro. That's right. What's my favorite Forza game? Um, I haven't played too many of the 360 ones. It's not like I really um, play them thoroughly. But I started playing FM3 like by myself maybe about a couple weeks ago, Barney? And FM3 is so fucking fun. Like, I, I watched the real Emil um, LP Forza 3, and dude, that game looks so much fun. Eight seconds. Oh god, it's gonna be over already. It's gonna be or over before we know it. Forward away. Forward right. I mean, I know this car is OP, but at the same time, it's a rally race. It's supposed to be, you know, fast car, fast driver kind of thing. Seven right, finish. Imagine we somehow lost all the time that we gained there. It was a planned technical maneuver. Yeah, exactly. Jesus Christ, 10.1 seconds over DeSantis and the Impreza. But what, um, okay, I know it was Nurburgring, Rishi, but, and Ender, but what cars were you guys using at Nurburgring? Oh, you're in the McLaren F1, so Group 3 then. Okay. Oh, Jesus Christ. If we're getting these bad snow tracks already, imagine how the advanced rally is going to turn out. Yeah, how is that possible? Uh, PD. Oh, those are races to Cuba? What cars are you guys using for that one? That's the horn that says, go, go, go. Ah, uh, the understeer. Help. Can I use the handbrake? Yeah, that helped. That didn't help a little bit. Okay. Oh, N600. Why do N600s understeer so much? Why do road cars in general in GT Sport drive like ass? Two right. One hundred. Oh! Two left. Why am I driving with the chase cam here? Right. Like, I'll do chase cam at a Two track that I know, but I'm stupid enough to try it at a track that I don't know. That is randomly generated by PD. And this uh, co-driver doesn't really help, because two left long, what the hell is that? I'm used to, like, easy left, medium left, hard right, over crest, whatever. Not whatever the hell he's saying. I'm guessing the whole over 1,000, over 900, I'm guessing those are meters? But I'm American, we use miles here, okay? And we use inches. And we use yards. Oh, shit. Come on. Six left. That's a right. Two left long. <laughs> oh my god. I'm 12 seconds ahead. You've been playing a lot of Forza 3 lately? Nice. Yeah, he is a shitty co-driver. Like, I don't know what any of this means, honestly. Right. Like, okay, Salika, you're obviously a a man of um, rally culture, hence your name. Can you explain what three left long means? 
And what are the typical, what, what is the typical terminology that co-drivers are supposed to use? Because out of every rally game that I've played, which is like either Dirt, Colin McRae, or Need for Speed V Rally, I don't remember any of the rally co-drivers saying any of this stuff. Um, uh, my co- my spotter? Um, I don't- Oh, okay, Rishi, thank you. So three battles an hour, got it. See- See, I'm, I'm very ignorant, so I'm a bit retarded. Anyways, um, so about the coach or about the spotter, um, if I have a spotter for IndyCar, it would probably be my personal friends. Like, friends IRL that race oval stuff, because, yeah, they're oval racers. Or one of my buddy Jarrett, who's from the Pacific Northwest, so yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ, another one of these. Three means the severity of the turn? But, okay, is it, like, on a scale from, like, 1 to 10 or something? Like, or 1 to 5? I, I don't know. Three left. Okay, so no, I already read that. GT Sport with R Factor 2 slash racing road physics, dirt rally, off road physics, set of course drift physics, and project cars 2 visuals. If only we could get all that. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, I can see one of the cars making a left. Oh. Perhaps I shouldn't use chase cam for this one. Three left. Three right. Two right. One left long. Three left. Fast or tight? Okay. Two. Okay, well, at least I'm. Despite that hiccup in the beginning, I'm catching up to the Quattro. I mean, this car is massively OP for this race, anyways. It's because I really dropped all the weight, and I literally have the max amount of power um, possible for this particular race. trying to read your your comment sandwich but oh my god like I'm trying not to hit the wall at the same time I'm like reading it little by little so like pace notes so one means sharpest possible turn that isn't a hairpin less sharp and so on generally five to six side pin road hairpin is a hairpin a few okay square is nice yeah I figured square would be 90 and a 90 degree up corner but thanks for that info the Aniki mod for AC? Nope. I haven't played AC in a while. Too late, too long. I really need to download more mods and start playing AC. And doing some of the SRS races on there. Left 5 into right 3, tight into 500 crest into open hair. See, that's terminology that I understand. And I'm not saying that I understand it like, oh, hell yeah, I want to be able to nail the fucking corner, but it's just like, it makes sense to me. Mainly because of all the other rally games I've played. This is like a... Okay, first of all, it's math, not maths. I know, I'm just taking the piss out of you because, hey, we say math out here in America. I remember I had the discussion with Mushy, he's like, it's maths. I'm like, uh, is it? If you're not downloading mods for AC, you're no longer a sim racing driver. But, I've gotten viruses before. Nah, I've only had viruses from downloading GTA mods. 
and that was like back in I don't know 2008 I think 2007 maybe something like that it's like oh I want a Lamborghini in San Andreas and then like I downloaded it from some like Russian website and like I get a fucking virus Yeah, pace notes are difficult to get down, especially when you don't have a background in rally racing. Like me! I don't have a background in this. And really what it comes down to is just paying attention, like really paying attention to everything. Luka, that sucks. Dude, I cannot see anything ahead of me. Dude, that cockpit view is so bad. Like, look, everything just turns brighter. Holy shit. Yeah, no thank you. Not using the cockpit view. Um, it's okay. Like I said, I'm really bad at rallying, but hey, we have almost a one minute lead. What could possibly go wrong? Call me gray on PS1. I'm definitely going to consider it. Like that, for sure the one game that I really want to LP is Dirt 3. Dirt 3 is one of the games I really want to play. This is my favorite in the Dirt series. I love that game. Um, that, Rally Sport Challenge, Richard Burns Rally, eventually, when I, if I ever get my hands on it. Colin McRae. Uh, Sega Rally for sure, the second one, because the first one is just arcade. I don't know. Is there a career mode in the first one on Saturn? Adobe Flash, yeah, exactly. Play, um, play like, you know, those generic street racer games. Play Rally IRL. Oh, okay. Yeah, let me, let me just, uh, get my parents' credit card. Go buy a car, go buy a roll cage. Fine, right. Sandwich? That is such a good question. Right. Salika, would you be able to answer that? One left long. Ah, in the wall. I'd be down for that, Jay. If I had my own place to store a car, that is. See, the problem is with the problem with me doing lemons is that I don't I, I don't live by myself, and I don't live with a you know I don't live in a place that has a garage. Therefore, I cannot store a car. If I can't store a car, I'm not leaving a race car on the street. Especially not at this point. Oh shit. Yeah, shit. Three left. I think you guys can tell I'm really bad at this. But that's okay, because we can be bad together. Two left long. Like one big happy family. Two right. Oh, you can make them however you want. Okay, so let me read your previous. Two oh, left. they're made according to FIA regulations. Right. Oh. Interesting. Can we take? Can we overtake all of these cars before the start finish? Maybe, possibly. We'll find out. Six left. South second liver needs a new turbo fan. Two left. Two right. Oh, is he a Scott? I can't tell. Sorry, GTSB. The only language I speak is America. Shit. <laughs> Five 
Can you overtake a real life rally? If you're fast enough, I think. Yeah. But realistically speaking, the AI is really bad here. And I'm driving a car that is ridiculously quick at this, you know, these circuits because I dropped all the weight and I put a big ass turbo in it. So I'm just passing by these guys quickly. Hey, what's up, Mushy? How are you, man? I couldn't get him. Finish. It took him three hours and thirty minutes. Well, doesn't the advanced rally take like two hours? <laughs> Cat cool bad. <laughs> The Pokemon Scottish player model memes? I have no idea, I've never seen them. You're tired? Dude, I was tired like the last two days just because like I um whatchamacallit? Um either working late and because of the time change. Because of the daylight savings change and yeah, I um Barely got any sleep, and then on top of that, parking in my neighborhood is so bad that, like, there's actually a- the only place that I could have parked during the, you know, the last two days was on a street where you- where you cannot park there at 6 in the morning, so me falling asleep at 3 in the morning, having to get up at 6 in the morning to go move the car, so I get up, I get up, I go walk, um, like, half a mile to go move my damn car, worrying about getting shot or worrying about getting mugged again, and it's like, uh I'm, I'm already awake at this point. I can't go back to sleep. 28 hours. Jesus Christ, Mushy. How is this still a problem? Yeah, I wonder that Six too. Right. I just realized something. That Audi Quattro that's ahead of us. I used that thing during the beginner rally. Why is it here? And that thing was massively underpowered. Not massively, but it was a bit underpowered compared to the Renault 5. So why the hell is it here? left milk out this morning. Jesus Christ, you see me. Fuck it up, man. The problem is that you can't get the smell out. It's gonna take a long time to do so. Too late long. Yeah, the AI logic can be Kind of a dumb car choice, but yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm just gonna go ahead and use, um... Group B cars for the advanced rally because I just don't care because I really suck at this. Six left. I bet you there's someone watching right now. They're like, ah, not even listening to his co-driver. What a fucking scrub noob. Like KYS noob. Yeah, I'm really terrible at this, like, and it doesn't help that I don't understand what the hell the AI or the co-driver saying. Then again, can you really blame this game? I mean, it, they packed in so much stuff, I don't, I don't think, you know, it's not a dedicated rally game, so. Oh, fuck the understeer. How did I get a penalty? Never mind, don't question it. 
Yeah, I know that, Barney. I've played this game before. <laughs> Below he used one shot. Three left. Wait. Finish. Why is your mug getting delivered to your door? Bro, I don't think we've ever had milk delivery people since like the 1950s. We don't have milk delivery people unless you like order from Amazon Prime or something like they have the Amazon Prime shopping thing or whatever. I don't know. Yeah, milk delivery isn't really a thing. So close yet so far away from getting level whatever. 37 I think it is. I didn't I don't even know. I just You might be wondering how the hell do I not know? I just kind of skimmed through it and <laughs> didn't even bother reading it. Yep, we're close to 37. Alright, so the last card we're going to be using for the Tarmac version of this rally is... Uh... Uh... This thing, yeah, why not? Oh, Jesus Christ, I accidentally bought Racing Softs. Doesn't matter, look how much money I have. <laughs> I, yeah, I mean, I, I I can't even agree with that GCSP just because I don't know the Scottish language. <laughs> The milkman will drop off a fresh gallon and leave your wife with a quick shot of his milk before you got home. Look how much money I <laughs> Oh, god damn it, Ender. So it's two Mitsubishis and two Subarus. Cool. And they're both silver and they're both blue. Oh, okay, so it's kind of like a team rally, I guess. Oh god. Now, if there's some standard cars that haven't um, transitioned well from PS2 to PS3, it's this one. This is definitely one of them that hasn't uh, transferred that well. I don't know why I decided to use this car. I could have used the... Oh yeah, I forgot the thing that the, the flaps in the back. That active arrow though. It's kind of fancy. You know, kind of like holding your pinky up when you drink a, a cup of tea. I don't know what the hell I'm saying. Look at that active arrow, underbreaking. Only the best aerodynamics here on this channel. Wait, you're American sandwich? I thought you were from Europe, just like everybody else. Okay. That's awesome. <laughs> Yay. That's one for the 1776 boys there. Okay, we win. Can Am would like to ban you. Yay. All right. So let's hope that the second rally stage isn't terrible.
What the heck is this car? Um, this car is... I don't even know what the hell this is supposed to be. It's supposed to be some sort of Mitsubishi concept of some sort. Oh, God. Look at the infield. Infield. The second sector, I mean. Whatever. The, mid -sec the middle section of the circuit. Looks like a holocaust. <laughs> yeah, it's a thingus. That's what it is. Japanese version of Night Rider. Oh god, there's a kink. Okay. Yeah, this is the ultimate Think Honk machine. Seven right. Seven left. Three left long. I don't even remember what Rhino would call wagons. Maybe they'd call them Thingus. I, I don't know. 100. Oh, fuck. Five left. Three right. Oh, is that the same horn as the Eclipse? No, it's not. My car isn't really a thick punk machine. Maybe it was the 3000 GT. At least I haven't driven an Eclipse in this game yet. Five right. One hundred. Two right. Oh no. Damn, now that's a sad standard cockpit. Like, some of the other ones actually kind of look like cockpits. This one just doesn't. It just looks like a big, you know, black space in the bottom and then just a black line running through the top. Most likely because of the window, the way the window is, but... Six right. Yeah. Three left. Two right. Oh! <laughs> the rear of this car is really designed the face structure of anim animatronics. Jimmy didn't know that his bay is in the game now. Oh, you're talking about GT Sport? The Unos Roadster? Oh my god, we're behind by four seconds. That's been causing us. Yeah, well, I know I mentioned this before, but one thing that kind of pissed me off is, like, if they had standard cars, what they should have just done was the cars that were convertibles in GT4 that you could, you know, that had cockpits, that you, obviously you couldn't drive a cockpit view, they should have just imported them over for, for the cars that had the respective cockpits, so, like, the all the MX-5s, um, the SLK-230, finish the 350Z Roadster, they should have just done that for all of those cars, but they didn't. At least I made up a second. But I'm probably third now. Yep. Okay, we cannot fuck this up again. So, I'm gonna stick with uh, the roof cam. No more bumper cam, no more horrible cockpit cam. Bumper cam on occasion, but yeah. You can tolerate FNAF? I, I cannot. I, 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 I hate Five Nights at Freddy's with a burning passion.
Oh really, Salika? I just read your comment about the uh, the voice actor for the Polish version of this game. Well, this circuit isn't really that... Circuit. This particular stage isn't that complex. So... I don't expect to crash out or anything. Okay, that's a good start. That's a good start. Five right. Three right. When you type ten right. instead of stop. Three I know right. we're back in 2008, Sandwich. Three left. Oh, fuck. Four right. Three left long. Okay, yeah, we won. I was somehow afraid that we were gonna lose, like, just randomly or something, but... What did we do? 2.2 seconds! We should be back in the lead! Yep, by only two tenths of a second, alright. So on to stage four. Yay. <laughs> you were waiting for him to say, all right, gang, let's split up. Scooby-Doo is one of those shows where it's like, they should have just stopped making them. Like, they should just stop rebooting them every single time because, like, none of the new ones are good. Just like Tom and Jerry, none of the new episodes are even good at all. Shaggy Scooby, you guys take the left three to the hairpin right. Me, Daphne, Ella, and Velma will go five right over Crest. <laughs> God damn it, the OMO and it gives that WO look. Here we go. general that wasn't the um th th that wasn't the classic scooby-doo it, it just sucks dude especially that live action movie my god was it terrible i remember seeing it in the theaters too i think it was like 2003 i think Yep, I knew it. Come on, come on, go, 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 go. Two right. I think Velma, I say. Oh, yeah, she was pretty banging in that movie. It was pretty hot. That's about it. Oh, fucking hell. Three seconds. Dude, that penalty really costed me a lot of time. Alright, we gotta try to make it up. Two left, four 
right, four left. Damn, we met up a lot of time. Okay. You see, that's why, like, it's hard for me to read chat right now and to do this because I don't, obviously, we don't know this circuit. Unless you've done the Gran Turismo Rally over and over again, I don't know the circuit at all, so it's just like, ah, uh, I want to talk to you guys at the same time. Uh, I want to learn. I want to get, I want to get good at this circuit. Three right. Oh, fuck. Turning in way too early. Two right. Oh, really, sandwich? Okay. I gotta take a look at that one when I'm done with the stream for educational purposes. Just for, you know, a, a college research project. For my, um... Okay, I think we should be able to win. Yep, we won. Cool. Awesome, okay. Cool, 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 cool. I haven't saved the replay yet at all. We need to save a replay for a thumbnail. So I'll take care of that right now. And time for the final rally in the entire video slash tarmac rally of the intermediate section of the Gran Turismo rally. Please give me like some easy circuit. Give me some like circle looking thing. Yeah, no kidding, Barney. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> I don't think I can keep looking at this semi wedge boy anymore without just feeling disgusted. I think I feel an artery. Wait, why? Was that an was that an actual line in the movie? Yeah, I'm using Group B cars for the for the damn rally. So Delta S4, um, I know I'm not going to get a Group B car for, you know, this price. I know for a fact I will not get a Group B car. But, whatever car I get, I'm adding a turbo for the Advanced Rally because I just don't care. Sandwich. I mean, it's a cartoon, so I don't really care. <laughs> I like my women uh, real.
Oh, it's one of the new episodes. Wait a minute, they... So they have a new Cartoon Network series on Scooby-Doo or what? Or a Boomerang or whatever? I don't know if you... I don't even know if the... If you're up to we get to Boomerang. I know Cartoon Network is a worldwide thing, but... And before Death Strand is revealed as Death Strand. Please don't penalty. Okay, we're good, we're good. Dude, that corner looks so much more wider than it was. And I wouldn't be surprised if that particular penalty just cost me the whole entire rally. Probably not because it was a slow section that, we, that I got it, you know, the penalty at, but still. Why aren't the headlights on? The sun is setting. Why the hell are the headlights not on? Can I imagine Gran Turismo with a Metal Gear Solid plot? Hmm. I think Salika can go from here and like give us a MGS Gran Turismo plot. Metal tank car gear. Yeah, yeah. The Jay Leno tank car is. You know, it's, it's a. It has a bunch of um, missiles strapped on it, and a water cannon, and a bunch of other shit, too. Yeah, but the Gran Turismo doesn't have the Dodge Stealth, and that's the only stealth car that I know for a stealth mission. Oh, fuck, we end the rally here. Okay, please tell me I won this stage. Oh, no. Please tell me... Oh, no, 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 no. 1.2 seconds. Um... Oh, thank God! Holy fuck! Look at the gap! Wow! Wow, holy shit, look at the gap between myself and Di Stefano in the Impreza. Oh my god, dude, I was shitting brakes there. I really thought I was gonna have to do this all over again. Oh my god. Unbelievable. Winner, winner, brick shitter. It's actually a pretty good one. I never, I never thought of that one before. Wow, okay. Well, thank God if I didn't lose the fucking rally because I would have probably just ended the stream there because I, I don't feel like doing that again. All right, so for winning the Grand Church Monday Immediate Rally, we win a rally car. We really do. So yeah, a rally car coupon. So... In the beginner series, we won a rally base car, which was the ended up being the Lancer 83, which sucked because we can win that car elsewhere. So for a rally car, please don't be the Citroen C4, please don't be the Delta S4, which I doubt it will be, and uh, please don't be the Impreza 99. It's standard. 206? Oh, a Focus. Okay, cool. I'll take it. I don't have one of those. And before the C4. I would use the C4. You see, here's the thing. I have a C4. I would use it, but the problem is that I don't want to use it because we already used it a bunch for the Sebastian Loeb challenge, so it's like, eh. <laughs> solid pod, liquid pod, and solidus pod. The most underrated rally car in the series. Is this thing kind of underappreciated? I don't know. Is it? If it is, that sucks. So anyways, guys, that is it for the Gran Turismo Intermediate Rally. Next time on Gran Turismo 5 A-Spec, we go back to the Amateur Series and decide to do... Do-do-do-do-do, the European Hot Hats Championship.